was um, overly excited. I was so excited because it is something we've been looking up to. Uh, I think um, we had the opportunity to reform the football association. <laughs> Joe, to be honest, I don't understand why people are thinking about competitions now. There is the need for us to reform first before we think about competition. Other than that, the whole exercise is, is an exercise in futility. If we are rushing to go back into competition, then we have no business dissolving the FA. There is the need for us to take our time to reform. That is the fundamental thing every Ghanaian has to think about. Over the years, we've been to so many competitions. What have we got to show for it? Since Libya 82, how many years now? Over 30 years. What have we got to show for it? We have spent millions of dollars in, in Africa Cup of Nations chasing a trophy that is worth $1.5 million. What have we got to show for it? We've been to Commonwealth Games, we've been to Olympic Games, we've been to Women AFCON, we've been to Men's AFCON club competitions, and they've all come to naught. So I don't see why people are rushing thinking about competition. There is no need thinking about competition now. Let's put our house in order so that when we come back, we come back in full force to make impact, not to become also runs and, and participants. I think the, the best opportunity is now. You know when you have the spirit of the nation behind you and for, for, for a certain decision to be taken and you wait for, for that feeling to leave the system, it becomes difficult. Immediately after Brazil, the euphoria was that, no, we needed changes at the Football Association. Everybody's spirit was behind the president at the time to take that decision. He allowed that opportunity to slip by. Now this, the, the nation is united for a purpose that let's change the system, let's reform. This is the brightest of opportunities, no need to wait. Um, nobody should think that FIFA is, is stereotype, FIFA is, is robot, and, and you, you take any decision and they just come and bam, we have, we have sanctioned you, no.